So I'll do a quick overview. I get asked a lot what I use to take pictures and set up my telescope. Um, you can see tonight it's going to be 20 degree weather uh, overnight. So I set up the little pup tent with my little command sender in there. Uh, backup battery tank for the focuser, which right now is sitting outside the Starzona Feather Touch micro focuser. This is a 12 volt battery pack. It's got six 12 volt ports on it for power. I have uh, outside temperature probe that also you probably can't see it has a probe underneath the heating element on my main mirror and main glass which keeps the optics warm surface pro which lets me control all this mess um, over here kind of work my way around the mount that's the control for the heating straps which keeps dew off hopefully um, on my mount my counterweights here um, got the Celestron Sky Sync um, GPS module, hand controller computer, which keeps it all under control. That ties in to the Star Sense, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, azimuth and altitude controls here. Um, all the different ports to control it. This is a new toy QXY Pole Master, which basically helps point them out directly at the center of rotation which is known as the north celestial pole in the northern hemisphere the optical tube itself uh, set up with my hyperstar tonight um, basically this lets me take pictures from the front of the telescope which gives me a wide field of view gives me really good quality shots of nebula and galaxies my attic 490 ex camera which that's the camera that takes the deep sky shots walking around we got the um, celestron star sense computer and camera what this does is it looks at the sky <clears throat> maps where it is so it can point to whatever you want to look at with the hand controller and then i've got my finder scope which has been converted to a guiding scope with the star sense camera basically this through this cable sends corrections into the mount over here this got a USB cord that goes into the computer and it corrects everything through software. <clears throat> and then off the back, if I'm doing visual observing, which is rare, um, got my eyepiece back in the back. And so that's what it takes and a lot of cords and computer controls and everything to make all this work. Uh, but it's worth it unless you get cloudy skies like it's looking right now, although it's supposed to clear hopefully tonight and I'll get some good data, keep you posted.